Hey guys, it's John from Everyday Survival. Are you guys ready for the awesome? In fact, it is so awesome that I have to contain a lot of it through this camera or it will make your head practically explode. Are you ready for this? Bam. Look at that. My first Bark River. This is the Bravo 1.5. It's an A2. Not even taking it out of the sheath. This knife is just beautiful. It's amazing. It's awesome. Stitching and everything on it's perfect. Real thick leather. Came really tight, but you know, I'd want it. It's going to loosen up and it's already loosened up real good. Let's take it out of the, out of the sheath. Man, look at that. Look at the contouring of that handle. It's like Coke bottle. Just fits my hand. It's perfect. Perfect. The ramp, so far, it doesn't get on my nerves. The jipping's pretty aggressive, but it doesn't bother me that much yet. Um, bevel's perfect. Uh, convex grind, you know, if you don't know that. Um, I will go ahead and say, it did not come, getting out of frame here, it did not come the sharpest whenever I first got it. But I don't blame Bark River for that. Could be their fault. Could not be. Um, but, you know, it, it could have been bouncing around when it was shipping. And it's A2, so it's not the most corrosion resistant. So it could have got some rust on the edge. Dulled it up a little bit. But I bought the um, the strop kit with it. And just that black compound, man, just brought the edge right back up. It's shaving sharp now. I mean, whew. And I was surprised, even on camera, this is going to look real bulky. The handle is going to look big. The blade's going to look real long. It actually... I know it's going to show up bulky, but it ain't. It's just, and especially it being this thick, it just looks like a tank of a knife, and it probably is. Um, but it's, it, I have small hands, and it fits my hands perfect. Plenty of extra room off of it. I don't know how they done it, but I get my, like, fingernail. I can't feel the spine and the handle or where they, like, separate. I can, the closest I can feel is right here on the edge. But I have to really be digging in there to get that. I can't can't feel the pins where they separate the handle. It's all perfect. Everything's lined up good. Everything's even. I love it. This is gonna be a quick teaser video. I'm not gonna be editing this because well I probably will, you know. But uh, I wish I could get out and test this thing sooner. But Christmas time just busy time of the year with my family. I promise there will be more interesting videos. I'm trying to make these things <laughs> as interesting as possible. But there's only so much I can do on my freaking porch. And the sheath, man, the sheath's perfect. I'm excited about the sheath as I am the knife. Um, put the fire steel in it. That did not come with it. I, I just overall love this thing. Just wanted to show that off because I could not contain myself. I could not. Oh, that snap's awesome. It... It snaps in awesome. So, as a quick teaser video. So, I kind of, you know, show off my new knife I got for Christmas. So, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Please go down in the comment section. Leave me a comment. And if you didn't like the video, like it. If you did like the video, leave a like and comment because I like comments. And as always, thanks for watching.